Hey guys, this is Unifarm and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today's video is a really special one and I'm super excited because I draw a picture um, for a voted theme and this theme was voted by the fans of the YouTube Artist Collective on their Facebook page for September. And even though I'm not an official member of this collective, I saw the theme and I thought, oh, this is so cool, I definitely participate and draw a picture. And I also did this for the last two voted themes, which were Wicked Wonderland and Beautiful Nightmare. And I put you the links for these two videos in the description box below, so if you like to, you can check them out and also watch these two speed paintings. And a little bit more information about the YouTube Artist Collective. It's basically joining together, I hope that's the right word, um, of different YouTube artists. And every two months the fans of their Facebook page are able to vote a theme. And for that theme all of the artists of these members will draw a picture and then they upload their videos and then you can watch um, all of their drawings and I think it's a really cool idea because you can see how different the interpretation of one theme could be and uh, it's cool. <laughs> I really like the YouTube Artist Collective and I'm also a fan but I didn't vote. I don't know why I didn't vote but yeah I forgot to do this and yeah you can find the links to all of their official members in my video description as well so you can check out their videos for steampunk and there you can find also the link to their facebook page and there you can um, become also an a fan of their page and vote for the next theme yeah that's all i have to say for the collective um, and yeah, in the description box you can find also all my materials I used for doing this drawing and there are also the links for my other social media profiles so if you like to you can follow me there too and if you are interested in getting some art stuff by me, e.g. some prints or coloring pages for printing at home you can check out my Etsy shop and yeah, that's basically all my description box. And now about my drawing. Um, I started this drawing like I nearly every drawing um, start and that's doing some research on Google search and Pinterest and doing some thumbnails, sketching some things and yeah first idea I had was doing a steampunk couple and then I sketched out other things like an animal in steampunk style and um, also something in my comfort zone that's a girl with a nice fancy outfit but then I thought no you don't do everything uh, you don't do a drawing in your comfort zone again and you try out the steampunk couple and um, I rarely uh, sketch two people on a piece of paper or in, in a drawing, so that's a little bit difficult for me. And yeah, but it's good to do something challenging. And now I'm really happy with the result. I, th I think I like the girl more than the boy because he looks a little bit stiff. I don't know, but I couldn't sketch it sketch it out in a better way but anyway normally the longest part when doing a drawing is the coloring process for me but for this one it was definitely doing the line art and the pencil sketch because the outfit of this couple of these two figures uh, have so much detail in it and it took me really long for designing this and yeah that I finally liked the outfit and I also have to say that I am not a member of the steampunk scene. Um, I have no idea if there are parts in an outfit that never ever could be um, in an outfit or that are uh, different parts that never ever could be worn together and yeah. I say sorry, I don't know. I 
just pick um, some details of outfits I saw on the internet and combine them in a way that I like the outfit and yeah that's how um, and then the designing process uh, was for me and for coloring I decided to use Kaffee I've done this years ago and it was uh, really fun I don't know why I didn't do this for this long and for steampunk um, I had the idea that coffee would be really fine and um, the a great coloring a way to color this picture for a steampunk couple and so I decided to use a uh, yeah, light brown for the, the overall picture and then I used coffee powder for the darker shades yeah and that's basically how I colored the picture and that was really yeah really easy for me to color with just one one color <laughs> with just coffee in different shades um, because um, I have really big problems in choosing colors and in this picture I only have to had to deal with brown shades and the gold and yeah it was really fun um, drawing this picture and coloring this picture that's basically all I have to say about my steampunk drawing and if you have participated in this theme of the YouTube Artist Collective too without being a member let me know in the comments and you can also write what do you think about my picture in the comments and if you like to see more of my art videos I would be really happy if you subscribe to my, my channel and yeah that's all I have to say and we see us in the next video. Bye bye!